Have you ever been to a party where someone told a joke and screwed up the punchline because they got impatient? We live in a society that values speaking over listening in most cases, so it can be really tempting to fill any silences that might happen. Indeed, sometimes silence even makes us profoundly uncomfortable, and we can be desperate to do anything to get rid of them. As a storyteller though, silence and delayed gratification can be used to build tension, keep the audience on the edge of their seats, or even for laughs. For example, let's say you want to make your audience laugh by making them so uncomfortable that they don't know what to do. You might set up a simple stupid joke like this. Knock knock. Who's there? And just wait it out and stare awkwardly. This is a tame example, but I bet even you felt uncomfortable waiting for the punchline that never came. You can play off audience expectations by building silence into your stories or by using pauses to make them wonder about what you might say next, as in this example. I went to the hospital last night to pick up my prescription. In this case, they expect something horrible in that pause and instead get something so mundane and ordinary that it might even make them laugh. When telling stories, try to creatively use silence and intentional pauses to your advantage. It almost always results in increased audience engagement and attention.